Medical. Oh, uh, yeah, I've been fitting the wall and acting fine. If y'all has it, do got what I need for my business. Uh, <clears throat> for medical supplies? That's right. I, and I'm, I call long distance from Beverly Hills. I've been gotten to find nothing but the bestest, most high quality supplies. You hear what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm the most respected gynecologist in Beverly Hills. I'm looking for high quality. You're talking to the gynecologist to the stars. Okay. All right. Don't, come on, come in some slack. Don't be laughing. All right. <laughs> All right, I'm not going to be laughing. Well, what, did did y'all got a uh, tongue depressors? Oh, yeah. What brand? We, 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 hand, we handle Oh, that sounds good. This mm -hmm. ain't for the patient. This is for me. I just like to chew on them. You hear what I'm saying? Oh, I, I hear that. I, I got so many women that come in and get themselves examined. I get all antsy and fidgety <laughs> and, and jumpy and jittery. You know, I start to perspirize. Yeah. You know, I, I, I shuffle my feet. I can't concentrate. But if I chew on a, a bat stick, I feel good. I feel. I like, gotta understand 20, it. I feel 23 years old again. You hear what I'm saying? I understand that. I chew on them all day, and I, I, I go through about 100 a day. I see. What about uh, uh, the uh, rubber gloves? What you uh, got, size nine? No, I tell you what we got. We handle the gloves uh, uh, called. Are you familiar with that glove? I just want the uh, crab resistant. Cause I got so many nasty bitches coming in to get themselves examined. I just a uh, crab resistant. They <laughs> said right. I, yeah. I don't like like the cheap kind. You have to put on two, three, four uh, gloves. Yeah, yeah, I understand. But what uh, about uh, uh, does y'all got the uh, the the little itty bitty? Uh, mini trial size uh, gyno gyno in, in a box. <laughs> no, we don't. But you know what I'm talking about? It's all greasy and it smells kind of funky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Gyno <laughs> Y'all don't have that. All right. Well, what about, uh, 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 does y'all have a, uh, neon signs? A uh, neon signs? I need to get a uh, neon sign. The supermodel, they can't find my office. You know, <laughs> come in one time for an appointment and got lost. <laughs> <laughs> She's walking up and down Rodeo Drive. I'm serious. She's looking all over the place. Couldn't find my office. Maybe I get a neon sign, you know, put up there and say, gynecologist to the stars, and they can find a place. I got you. But I I'm got right you. here in Beverly Hills on Rodeo Drive. I need to get a, a neon sign. Well, what we need, we need to get your address and phone number. All right. I'm at 9525 Rodeo uh -huh. Drive, uh -huh. room 447, uh -huh. Beverly Hills, California. Okay. What's your zip code? 90210. Nine oh two one oh. So Litton, who, who who your favorite star? Who is that my favorite star? Ask me anything about anybody. They all come into my office one time or another. Is that right? Ask me anything. Who you like? You are uh, Kathy <laughs> Rosie <laughs> Honey, <laughs> Roseanne. Ask me anything about anybody. <laughs> who your favorite star? Come on, ask me anything. Oh, uh, oh man, you know. Come on, it, I know. It'd probably be Kathy. Kathy, oh, ooh, ooh, she came in one time with a yeast infection. <laughs> I'm serious, I'm from under cheese. That shit was everywhere. I had to put on five rubber gloves for that shit. <laughs> I tell her, guess I'm a guy with a set, set eight, set nine, set ten, and get the hell out of my office. <laughs> Nasty. I tell her, don't, don't ever come back again. Next time she come in, I go out on, on vacation. I get the hell out of it. I go down to Elsa Gunner or something. <laughs> But I'm so lit, I'd be gotten to get myself a neon sign. Oh, man. Oh, so man. So who else you like? Who are your favorite star? Oh, man, you're like killing that. me. You're it ain't killing always me. like that. Sometimes it, it, usually it's supermodels that come in, you know, like, you know, I walk in an examinizing room. I didn't have to tell her to take her clothes off. She's standing there looking good. That's good. Dang, I, I done seen in a long time. I take a look down there. I said, that that look good, damn woman. Upstairs and down, junkyard with me, like that. <laughs> So listen, you, you give me a good prize on the medical supplies because I'm gonna be visiting out there, and you give me. A good you come on out here, man. You, you, I'll, you I'll give, give you a good. I'll give me a good prize on the supplies. I'll sell you some hubcaps real cheap. Okay, all right, man. That sounds like a good trade, buddy. Y'all need to buy some hubcaps. Uh, hey, man, I'm always in the market for some good hubcaps. Oh, that sounds good. <laughs> I'm always in the market. So, listen, uh, uh, I'm on my lunch break. I'm going to go out and smoke a cigar, play some shuffleboard, but I'm going to be right back in the okay, office. Man. I, got, I got some supermodels coming in to get themselves examined, so we can do some business. All I'm right, back. buddy. All that right. Sound, that sounds like a plan. All right, man. All right. Bye.